Hello everyone. Today I am going to explain about Legendre's differential equation. Legendre's differential equation. The differential equation in the form of the differential equation in the form of 1 minus x square into y double dash minus 2 x y dash plus n into n plus 1 into y is equal to 0. This equation is known as Legendre's differential equation where n is a real number. You by had this equation. This equation is known as Legendre's differential equation. Rain is a, this above equation it can also be written in the form of can be written as d by dx of 1 minus x square into dy by dx plus n into n plus 1 into y is equal to 0. That means the differentiation of these two terms you will get you this one. Now uh, you can write this equation in this form also just remember. By had this Legendre's uh, differential equation and uh, this uh, if you solve the Legendre's differential equation you will get one solution. If you solve Legendre's differential equation you will get one uh, solution. That, that solution is known as Legendre's polynomial. It is denoted by Pn of x. Whenever if you solve this differential equation, this Legendre's differential equation, if you solve, you will get one solution. That solution is known as Legendre's polynomial. It is denoted by Pn of x. Pn of x, what is mean by Pn of x? Pn of x is uh, Legendre's polynomial. Now, after that, we have one important formula is there. What is the formula? Very, very important formula to do the remaining problems. Uh, generating function of Legendre's differential equation. Just like formula, you have to remember to do the remaining sums. We need this formula very much important. Generating function of Legendre's differential equation. What is the generating function? 1 minus 2xt plus t square whole to the power of 1 by 2. 1 minus 2xt plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity t to the power of n into p n of x or uh, whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 means what under root of 1 by under root of 1 minus 2 xt plus t square is equal to this is the RHS. This is called generating function to do the remaining problems. We need this one just like formula you just remember. This is generating function. Now we have an important theorem. This important theorem is uh, important for two marks especially prove that uh, uh, Pn of 1 is equal to 1. Theorem is there for 2 marks. This is very very important. Pn of 1 is equal to 1. Pn of minus 1 is equal to minus 1 to the power of n. P of, uh, P2m of 0 is equal to this one. P2m plus 1 of 0 is equal to 0. This is the uh, question. Uh, prove that uh, we have to prove first one, second one, third one. This is one theorem important for 2 marks. Uh, we will prove one by one. We will prove all the three points one by one. First one, Pn of 1 is equal to 1. I am going to prove the first one. By the generating function, previous just now I told you now one formula, uh, generating function formula, this function. By generating function formula, we know this formula, 1 minus 2xt plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to, sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity, d to the power of n into Pn of x. By putting x is equal to 1, if you substitute x is equal to 1 in this uh, generating function, what you will get x is equal to 1 wherever x is there x is equal to 1 you will get 1 minus 2t plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to n pure sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity t to the power of n into pn of 1. 1 minus 2t plus t square is nothing but 1 minus t whole square to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to this one. 2 to get cancelled 1 minus t whole to the power of minus 1 is equal to as it is 1 minus t whole to the power of minus 1 by binomial theorem we can write 1 minus t whole to the power of minus 1 is equal to 1 plus t square plus t cube plus t to the power of 4 plus and so on t to the power of n plus and so on is equal to again the same RHS. Comparing coefficients of t to the power of n on both sides. Comparing coefficients of t to the power of n on both sides. You will get pn of 1 is equal to t to the power of n coefficient is 1. pn of 1 is equal to 1. pn of 1 is equal to 1 you will get. Now the second one. The second one is Pn of minus 1 is equal to Pn of minus 1 is equal to minus 1 to the power of n. We have to prove that one. 
by generating function again the same formula 1 minus 2 xt plus t is equal to to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity e to the power of n into pn of x by substituting x is equal to minus 1 in this equation we will get 1 minus of minus plus 2t plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to like this. In this equation we are substituting x is equal to minus 1. So that we will get this equation. This is in the form of 1 plus 2t plus t square is in the form of 1 plus t square whole square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2. 2 2 get cancelled is equal to this one. Now 1 plus t whole to the power of minus 1 is equal to rhs side. Binomial expansion 1 plus t whole to the power of minus 1 if you expand alternatively plus and minus will get 1 minus t plus t square minus t q plus t to the power of 4 plus and so on minus 1 to the power of n t to the power of n plus and so on is equal to rhs side. Comparing the coefficient of t to the power of n on both sides uh, here left hand side t to the power of n coefficient is p n of minus 1 right hand side the coefficient of t to the power of n is minus 1 to the power of n therefore p n of minus 1 is equal to minus 1 to the power of n. The next one is third one. Third one, what we have to prove in the third one? Pm of 0 is equal to minus 1 to the power of m into the whole thing and Pm, P2m plus 1 of 0 is equal to 0. These two we have to prove. To prove these two, again we will write generating function formula. 1 minus 2xt plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 is equal to this one is the formula equation 1. In this above equation, we will substitute x is equal to 0 this time. Now, x is equal to 0 if you substitute, how much you will get? Wherever x is there, we will substitute 0. Uh, in place of uh, 2x, uh, x if you substitute 0, here 1, my, 1 plus t square whole to the power of 1 plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2. Now, sigma n is equal to pn of 0, sigma n is equal to 0 to infinity, pn of uh, t, t to the power of n into pn of 0 is equal to 1 plus t square to the power of minus 1 by 2. Now 1 plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2 binomial expansion if you expand 1 plus t square whole to the power of minus 1 by 2. Alternatively plus and minus will get 1 minus 1 by 2 into t square plus 1 into 3 by 2 into 4 t to the power of 4 plus in the same way 1 into 3 into 5 like that uh, 2 into 4 into 6 whole to the power of 6 whole to the power of t square t to the power of 4 in the next time you will get a t to the power of 6 you will get plus and so on alternatively plus and minus is there that is why minus 1 to the power of n the nth term will become 1 to 3 into 5 into and so on 2m minus 1 by 2 into 4 into 6 into 2m and uh, 2m into t to the power of uh, t to the power of 2m because uh, two t square t to the power of 4 t to the power of 6 t to the power of 8 that is why t to the power of 2m. Now, both sides if you are comparing coefficient of t to the power of 2m, t to the power of 2m coefficients if you compare on both sides, pm, p2m of 0, p2m of 0 is equal to left hand side, the right hand side the R, the co, co, coefficient of t to the power of 2m is this one, coefficient of t to the power of n. Similarly, equating the coefficient of t to the power of 2m plus 1, p2m plus 1 of 0 is equal to right hand side there is nothing that is why there is 0. This is the third one.